Hello and hello guys, welcome back once again, my name is Aspen Rat, and before I start of my reaction to the win of the 49ers, number one, I do apologise that I couldn't get online, um, as you can see, my computer's there, screen was there, everything was ready, and I was waiting, but sadly, the game wasn't on the NFL Game Pass, it was on Sky Sports, and I don't have Sky Sports. So that was my apologies. I didn't know at the time. I tried to look it up. Apparently it was on the NFL Game Pass. It couldn't be NFL Game Pass information. It went on there. So I do apologise for it not being on there. But for the love of God. I saw the game through a friend's app. Which I couldn't get onto my reaction to. And you guys to stream it and all that bits. I couldn't stream it. I couldn't do nothing. Basically but I saw the game. Unbelievable. The first quarter, Trey Lance, he did his all, he tried his best, and he got caught up with an ankle injury. Listen, it happens. I'm not faulting the man, I wouldn't doubt the man, it happens. So if he's out, who's your QB2? Who's your QB2? Jimmy Garoppolo comes out of nowhere and does what he does best. So... No one should fault Trey Lance at a bit. Trey Lance got caught up with an ankle injury. It happens. It has happened to a lot of rookies. And you can't tell me it hasn't. Because if you are a Fort Niners fan. Or just an NFL fan all over. You should know. But it's happened not just to a lot. You know, it's one rookie. It happened to a lot of rookies. Sadly, Trey Lance got caught up. And just like I saw... As you guys have saw, he got carted. He got carted off. It is what it is. So who's our QB two? And bearing in mind, you didn't have a QB three either. Brook, uh, Brock Prudy, Brook Prudy, he was out. Whatever your QB three was out, inactive. So whatever happened to Jimmy Garoppolo as your QB two happens. If Jimmy Garoppolo had a a broken ankle, it wouldn't have happened because. Who's going to cover a QB2? Well, QB3. Your QB3 weren't there. You had a QB2 and that was your QB2 that did. Doesn't matter if your QB2 had a broken hand. Your QB2 had to still do the same thing. Jimmy Garoppolo knew what he was doing. Doesn't matter. Injured or not injured. I was waiting for him to get injured. That's no lie. I was waiting for him to get injured. I was waiting. But throughout the... Throughout the Seahawks game, he did perfectly fine, as I expected from a QB, as I expected with Trey Lance. Sadly, Trey Lance didn't get his bit. He didn't get his full season. Jimmy Garoppolo covered him, as a QB2 should. That's, what's, that's what a QB2 should have done. Now, I don't care if you're not a 49ers fan, doesn't bother me at all. If you're a Bills, a Dolphins, a Saints, a Ravens, a Cowboys, a Colts, whatever, don't matter what team you're on, your QB2 is supposed to be great as your QB1. Rookie or professional, don't matter. 49ers, sadly, their QB1 um, sadly got injured. But your QB2, Jimmy Garoppolo, that a lot of people said, Time to get rid of. It's time to go. Even I said, no, one of a liar. If they if they can't get rid of a QB2, might as well keep them to do the rest of the work. If they can get rid of him, then there's money. That, that, that was my opinion before Jimmy G. Uh, I got traded off. But yet, yeah, here we are. Try and answer out with a knee injury. Probably out for a week, two, three, four, maybe. Who's going to cover your arse for today? Jimmy Garoppolo. And that's a good feeling. Jimmy Garoppolo did very well. Offensively, Jennings. I'm oh, sorry, not Jennings. Uh, Carl Juzic. And even Debo. Like, they, they all tried to push. Defensively, Jennings and Hufunga. And, listen, all the rest of the defence tried to keep him at bay. Which we did, and I thought, 
listen, I think... 49ers played really well, offensively and defensively. I thought we played well. Not great, but we played well, very well, to keep the Seahawks at bay. And I thought we did blindingly. Leave your comments, guys. Tell me down below what you think of the game and how it should have handled and so forth. But, guys, I thought we did all right. We've got a win. One win, one loss. That's on us. We've done it. That's against us. So, guys, leave a comment. Tell me what you think. Uh, thank you very much as well to 482 subscribers. Really appreciate it. I appreciate you guys subscribing. If you're new, subscribe. I've got more 49ers news, NFL news, and of course, I've got the live stream against the Chicago Bears and the Packers tomorrow, which will be on NFL Game Pass. I'll be live streaming it then. So, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys uh, on the next video.